There are gonna be times where people are gonna say no to you. Throughout my journey of running 100 marathons, so many people told me like, you're too young, you're gonna be injuring your body. But I think for me, it also was a motivator. Whenever someone tells me, oh, you can't do this, it's like, don't tell me that, I'm gonna go after it. <laughs> One of my favorite medals is the 2019 Big Sur uh, International Marathon Medal. This is the second time I ran my 18 miler for Sunis Run LA. I hold the record for the youngest Latina to run 100 marathons and the youngest woman to run 100 marathons. I think when I started my journey, the whole focus was just to kind of bring attention to, you know, what a dreamer was. I was born in Salvador, 1997. I came to the U.S. when I was six years old. ¿Cómo creció usted cuando estaba allá en El Salvador? ¿Hacía pupusas? Pues todo esto es la tradición de nosotros, las pupusas. Mm-hmm. We'll see how these come out. My mom always told me, like, very young, you know, like, it's going to be hard for you to get opportunities because you're not a citizen. I personally have been here for 20 years and I still don't have any pathway to citizenship. It could be taken away any moment. It could be taken away tomorrow. I was just like, okay, I just gotta work hard in whatever I do so then I could just get the same opportunities. Morning. When DACA came out, that gave me a way of me saying, oh wow, I could go to college, I could have a job. I could finally dream. We're in South Central LA. This is a community with a lot of Hispanics, Latinos. And I was like, that's so crazy. Like, she's Latina, she ran 100 marathons. And I was just like really overjoyed. I was like, wow, I'm trying to be like her. <laughs> Students for LA is a program that basically changed my life forever. It's a program in high school that helps you to prepare for the LA Marathon. So they gave you free shoes, free shirts, free races. I was very poor at that time, like I could not afford none of that. So obviously that really helped me and then I was able to continue. It opened up so many doors and it also gave me the opportunity to see that I can go after big goals and I just have to be very committed to it. To anyone who's going ahead and going after any goal or any dream, believe in yourself. You know your potential. There's nothing you can do in this world.